Our story begins in the year 1621 in the New World, now known as the United States. The Pilgrims, early settlers from England, celebrated their first successful harvest with a three-day feast. They invited the Native Americans, specifically the Wampanoag tribe who had taught them how to cultivate the land. Though we often imagine this first Thanksgiving brimming with roasted turkeys, historical accounts suggest otherwise. The Pilgrims and Native Americans likely feasted on a variety of game, including deer, fowl, and yes, possibly turkey. Yet the turkey was not the centerpiece of the table as it is today. Fast forward to the late 18th century. Sarah Josepha Hale, the editor of the popular women's magazine Godey's Ladies Book, started a campaign to establish Thanksgiving as a national holiday. She published recipes and stories glorifying the holiday, often showcasing turkey as the main dish. But why turkey? Hale may have been inspired by the fowls mentioned in the Pilgrim's accounts or perhaps by the practicality of the turkey itself. Turkeys were plentiful, large enough to feed a family, and unlike chickens or cows, were not needed for milk or eggs. In 1863, during the Civil War, President Abraham Lincoln proclaimed Thanksgiving a national holiday. The idea of a Thanksgiving turkey had been so well propagated by then, it naturally became associated with the holiday. In the 20th century, marketing and commercialization further solidified the turkey's place at the Thanksgiving table. The poultry industry began promoting turkey as the ideal choice for Thanksgiving, emphasizing its size and affordability. The presidential turkey pardon, a humorous tradition where the U.S. president pardons a turkey from becoming a Thanksgiving meal, added another layer to the turkey's Thanksgiving narrative. The first official pardon took place in 1989 under President George H.W. Bush, although stories of unofficial pardons date back to President Lincoln's time. From a possible dish at the Pilgrim's Feast to a symbol of Thanksgiving, the turkey has had quite a journey. The turkey's association with Thanksgiving is a blend of historical happenstance, cultural storytelling, and commercial influences. In conclusion, the turkey, once just a part of the possible game at the first Thanksgiving, has evolved into the undisputed symbol of the holiday. Its journey is a testament to the power of tradition, narrative, and commercial influence. As we carve into a juicy turkey this Thanksgiving, we're not just partaking in a meal, we're participating in a tradition centuries in the making.